All right, God bless you. I'm going to try this one more time and see where we go. I'll just do a short one this morning, and if this works out with this particular machine here, then I'll be able to um, broadcast again. So as um, we're going to read um, 1 Chronicles chapter 4, verses 9 and 10, and work our way on through the King James, New King James, and the Living Bibles. All right, let us pray and thank the Lord for bringing us here. Heavenly Father, in your precious name, bless us on this day, Lord, to walk up right before you and to do your will. And Lord God, when your trump sound, I pray, Lord, our souls will join up to be with you, Lord God, and not be left behind. Bless us on this day as only you can. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, going into the King James Version of First Chronicles chapter 4, verses 9 and 10. And Jabez was more honorable than his brethren. And his mother called his name Jabez, saying, Because I bear him with sorrow. And Jabez called on the God of Israel, saying, O oh, that thou wouldest indeed, excuse me, O oh, that thou wouldest bless me indeed, and enlarge my coast, and that thine hand might be with me, and that thou wouldest keep me from evil, that it may not grieve me. And God granted him that which he requested. That's King James. Now let's look and see what the New King James says. Now Jabez was more honorable than his brothers, and his mother called his name Jabez, saying, Because I bore him in pain. And Jabez called on the God of Israel, saying, Oh, that thou wouldst bless me indeed, and enlarge my territory that your hand would be with me, and that you would keep me from evil, that I might, excuse me, that I may not cause pain. So God granted him what he requested. Now from the Living Bible. Jabez was more distinguished than any of his brothers. His mother named him Jabez because she had such a hard time at his birth. In parenthesis, it means Jabez means distress a play on words. Jabez sounds like Ozeb, the Hebrew word meaning distressed. He was the one who prayed to the God of Israel, oh, that you would wonderfully bless me and help me in my work. Please be with me in all that I do and keep me from evil, excuse me, and keep me from all evil and disaster. And God granted him his request. So just um, wanted to read those scriptures to you today. And if this works, then I will come back with the rest of the lesson. So God bless you at this time. Peace and blessings unto you.